Yo, 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 big kish back up in here. I told y'all we're going to be doing these TikToks reactions to everybody else that's evil in Hollywood as well. We're not just going to be getting on Diddy and everybody else that's black. We just going to we just going to listen, man. We're not doing that. We're not doing this. You understand? We're going to be talking about everybody else. That got something to be doing that got something to do with. The Bohemian Grove, these parties, Michael Rubin parties, all white parties. You know what I'm saying? We about to be talking about all of them. It ain't just Diddy. You know what I'm saying? So without further ado, y'all know I don't like holding y'all. Let's get, get, get it. Did you know that singer Billie Eilish exposed one of Hollywood's deep, dark secrets during a live Q&A with her fans? No, I didn't know that. Y'all didn't know that. But we about, to, we about to see what Billy Eilish got to say. Come on, let, let's do some exposing, uh, Billy. You get hit on by old people. Um, the only people I get hit on are... A lot, dude. Who else said that? Remember in the Not Like Us video, where he exposed the, the, the model girl. The model girl, she was way under the age of 18. She was like, yeah, these guys at these modeling agencies, they kept trying to hit on me. They kept trying to, same thing. It's not just Diddy. I encourage y'all content creators, let's start uh, getting these other people too. Let's start reacting to these other people too. I know, I know the views ain't going to be there like that. I know that. I understand that. But we got to make it be. We got we to gotta, we gotta put our foot on their neck. Because it's not just Diddy. Let's get it, y'all. Everyone's a pedophile. Profile, profile, profile. Oh. It's really bad, like everybody's profile. Hollywood appears to have a long history of this kind of behavior. Actress Shirley Temple claimed MGM producer exposed- Dang! Who's the MB MGM producer? Exposed- Oh man, come on man. She was way under the age of 18. Shirley Temple. So this been going on. Diddy wasn't born in, uh, 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 not, no, 1934. Who is these people? Let's talk about it. It's not just Diddy. Let's get him. Get him. ...himself to her when she was 12 years old. Shirley Temple was a child star who achieved international stardom with the release of Bright Eyes in 1934. What about Hollywood producer Victor Salva? Who's oh, one of our favorite movies, Jeepers Creepers. We didn't know about him. It's not just Diddy. Get him. The child predator and is still allowed to work within the industry. Oh, he's still allowed to work in the industry? Oh. And, and Diddy locked up, but he allowed it? Oh, okay. I'm not watching Jeepers Creepers no more. If you got the movie Jeepers Creepers, I encourage you to please throw it out. We getting on y'all too. It's not just Diddy. Get him! Salvo was convicted in 1988 of the sexual molestation of Nathan Forrest, a 12-year-old actor and star of his film Clown House. Salva even ended up putting a joke about child molestation in his movie Jeepers Creepers 3. How many of you remember? Now, I ain't never see that part. I ain't matter of fact, I ain't never see Jeepers Creepers 3. But if you got any of the Jeepers Creepers, throw it out. You know what I'm saying? We we about to we about to yeah. We we parading over here. 80s actor Corey Feldman saying the biggest problem in Hollywood is affilia. Hollywood director and CEO James Gunn had a affilia themed party and even what he had a themed party he had a pdf file party at a pdf file themed party y'all pay attention y'all it's not just Diddy let's get it Wood is affilia Hollywood director and CEO James Gunn. Hollywood director James Dunn. Remember that name because they they they, they expect for us to forget their names. Matter of fact, we need to write these names down, y'all. James Dunn. What receipt is this? Okay, James Dunn. We need to get all of them. Come on, content creators. We got to get all of them. Let's go. It's not just Diddy. Had a affilia themed party and even made posts like this on Twitter. For the record, I'm against grape. Grapes. 
and ba- oh, huh? Unless you're really ah, it's not funny. You see, they think stuff like this is funny. This is back in two thousand nine. Why he wasn't on the news? Why his old stuff ain't coming it uh, coming up? You know, once once some once once somebody types stuff like this, more than likely it's everywhere else too, because that's what happens. They get comfortable. These guys. For the record, I'm against vape and baby eating in real life, unless you're really, really, really hungry. Now, YouTube, y'all bet not make my video go red or yellow. I'm not playing. I did all them Diddy videos. I did all them videos about black people. All them joints is green. I, I noticed that, too. I noticed that. As soon as I do something with these guys, that's when my joint don't want it. That's when my joint want to get demonetized and all of that stuff. I noticed that. Yes, I'm speaking up. I don't care. Putting it all on the line. Let's get it, baby. I like it when little boys touch me in my silly place. What? Yes. What? He tweeted this and it's millions of people on Twitter and they say nothing? Hold up. We, we got we to gotta run that back. We got to run that back. Really I like it when. Hold on. James Gunn said, retweet Peter Alton. I like it when little. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Yo. 4509, 851 AM. This is stuff they getting away with? Why is this stuff not on the news? It's not just Diddy. Let's get, get, get it. Little boy touch me in my silly place. Shh. Yes, this man is a CEO for one of the most powerful studios in Hollywood. And the vice president of Disney was convicted of sexually abusing a seven-year-old girl. Disney music executive was charged with child sexual abuse. This is a lot of people, y'all. It's not just Diddy. Y'all see this. Do y'all see the propaganda? Do y'all see the propaganda? You know what? You know what? I ain't doing no more Diddy videos. If I got to be the one, if I got to be the one, I ain't doing no more Diddy videos. That's it. Not until all these guys go down. All of them going down. Everybody got to go down. I ain't doing no more Diddy videos. All these guys got to go down first. Now, I am not trying to make no provision. I'm not trying to say Diddy what Diddy be doing to do Diddy, do Diddy, Diddy, do that, Diddy, Diddy. I'm not saying what he's doing. I'm not taking up for that. I'm saying everybody else is going down with him. Let's get it, y'all. What about former child star Bug Hall, who played Alf Alpha in Steven Spielberg's Little Rascal? That's my joint. Uh, two men from that set began sexually abusing me. Not Little Rascals. Alf Alpha. You are so beautiful to me. Can't you see? That's my joy. No, 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 Alfalfa. No, my bad, Alfalfa. I'm going to pray for you, baby. These pray predators have some sort of sixth sense for vulnerable kids. What about writer Stephen King, who wrote the novel it? that the horror movie It was based on, putting a child orgy into the book that didn't make it into oh. the movie? What about the satanic 90s rock star Marilyn Manson, who said he wanted to come up with a hookup dating app for children? What? A dating app for children? Called Kinder. That's short for kindergarten. Oh my, yo, son. These other people got to go down. I'm not doing no more Diddy videos. I'm doing, yo. Yo, y'all please like this video. For real, bro. I'm serious. I'm serious. They got to go down too. Like this video. Please. Please like this video, y'all. We got to do this together. They going down too. I'm serious. Let's get it. Bring light to the darkness. If you want to be a part of bringing light, what's done in the dark shall come to the light. If you want to be a part of this, like the video, y'all. 
Share the video. Subscribe. Come on. We got to get all of them. I don't like how they just got this dude all over the news like it's just him. Nah, you know what? I got to do my part too. I got to do my part too. Come on, God. Yeah, Drew Barrymore exposes Hollywood for what it really is. Get a load of this. But I've been an author all these years. I've never met the Olsen twins. He introduced me to them. I said to him, how do I tell them apart? He says, Ashley Swallows. You know what? I'm going to let it play, bro. I'm going to let it play. I'm going to let it play. And all of them laughing. All of them laughing. But Diddy can't even have no damn baby oil to massage his feet with. Yo, I'm going to let it play. Is it true that you used to give Mary Kate acting lessons? You tell her, act like this never happened. Hot Jacket, who f***ing f***ed that girl in 1990? And it's crazy, because it seems to be the theme with all these young stars. I may end up running off with you myself, you know. That's what Steven says. Steven, it's Steven Spielberg? Yeah. Hi, Steven, I love you. <laughs> Hollywood parties. Well, I've grown up very fast, and it's not very normal to see a nine-year-old at a big Hollywood party drinking. You heard that right. Nine years old drinking. Uh, not nine, I meant under the age of 18. Drinking. It's not just Diddy. And she telling y'all this on public TV. On national TV. Telling y'all this. But y'all want to think everything about Diddy. Me too. Me too. Everything ain't about Diddy. He was molded as well. Ain't nothing he did was right, but they, they, they got to go down too. Nine. My blood is boiling. Right At nine years old, she was at Hollywood parties getting drunk. And it's crazy how it's such a common theme for these childhood stars to get institutionalized for acting out. Actor Vin Diesel has been accused of sexual battery and creating a hostile work environment. Oh, really? Oh, really? I thought you was cool. I thought you was cool. Nah, he ain't cool. Y'all know, yo, y'all take screenshots of these people. We not supporting them no more. I'm not playing. That's according to a new lawsuit filed by one of his former assistants. This lawsuit comes from a... He fast. Ain't that Fast and Furious, dude? Yo, get rid of all your Fast and Furious movies. No more Fast and Furious. We done. We done. A former assistant of Vin Diesel and says that back in 2010 during filming of the fifth Fast and Furious movie that this assistant was in a hotel room with Vin Diesel and that she was trapped and that is when a Don't look at me like that. Yo, yo, stop looking at me like that. Stop looking at me like that. According to this lawsuit, she accuses Vin Diesel of forcibly pinning her up against a wall Kissing Yo. her and groping. I can't hear this. I can't hear this. I can't hear this. I thought you was cool. I thought you was cool. Yo, it's not just Diddy. I'm telling y'all. I need y'all help. I need y'all help. Like the video. Share it. Let's get it. Her. Now, this lawsuit also says that shortly after this alleged incident that she was let go from the company. She is suing not just Vin Diesel, but also his production company. She says that she was let go, which per the lawsuit she believes was in response to this alleged incident. So they doing sisters wrong when they come out and let, and let it be known what happened? They get let go? Huh? Yo. It's not just Diddy. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all. I need y'all help. Y'all like this video so I can get out there in the algorithm. Diddy taking everybody's phones before the party. You know what we did? This is going to be the last Diddy video we do. I bet you that. Mark my words. Mark my words. This is going to be the last one we do. Now, you ain't get, what you taking everybody's phones for, Diddy? 
I thought you was cool. But we gonna get everybody else too. Y'all just let's just watch this. What is he doing? What is you doing? He even took his daughter's phone. What is you doing? Right there, anybody could have backed out. Yo, hold on, I gotta use the bathroom right quick. Could have easily backed out. Now, where's they catching the boat to? They could have easily backed out. Yo, I gotta use the bathroom. I, I, I hold on, I'm, I'm gonna be right back and dip. Boop, out. I need your phone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. He geeked up Thank too. You. I can tell that he bites. Quincy, I know you have two phones, Quincy. Oh, there you go. That's what I love. Who Quincy? Quincy Wolf's son, right? Just glow. So proud of you, just glow. Look at that. Got all the phones. Do I have everybody's phone? So we got two cars. We got this car and the car over there. Um, how would you like to... I mean, yeah, we can go get it when we finish. Yeah. Is that that actor dude? Okay. Them, you're running across the world. Yeah, this has sure. been there for success where it's a door. It's a door. When you platinum and you're getting 50000 a show, I've been there. There's a door that you can walk in. I'm not sure if it's or if it's Illuminati. I just. Everybody be talking about them doors. Everybody talking about them doors, but they be getting ignored. Let's get it. Didn't started. take that though. I went straight. What do you, what do you mean? Yeah, this is listen. Talking. This is when you get to when you get to a level of success. When you get 30, 40, 50 thousand a show, you platinum. You're running across the world. There's a there's three different doors, right? There's three different ways to walk. There's to the left. There's to the right, and then there's straight. To, straight is your. Own. Let's see if you. Let's see if you continue this success, young man. Yeah. Let's see if, if it's all about your skills, young man. Let's really see that. Yeah. You That's letting them know that they done took over hip-hop. That's why I don't be fighting for hip-hop. Like, that, it, it's theirs. It's theirs. They got the money. Your face, your face ain't on a dollar bill. We got to stop saying something is ours, and it's not ours. Our face ain't on a dollar bill. They own it. They own it. Everything. That's why he said, yeah, you, okay, you walked in that door. You, okay, you walked the righteous path. And then we see how if you be platinum or something like that. Because they letting you know that we buy your, we, 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 buy, we purchase you able to be platinum and gold, whatever that is. Went straight. To the right. I'm not sure. Oh, shit right there. And then there's to the left, I'm not sure if there's some sacrifice shit going on right there. I'm not sure because I went straight. But I was offered these doors. Tell you what they do is they invite you to these parties, these house parties. And then they they be like, oh, Woot the Woot going to be there? Like your favorite rapper, the big ass person. And Woot the Woot going to be there? Oh, uh, before you get in, you got to give us your phones. There you go. There it go. Why ain't nobody talking about this? Why ain't nobody talking about this, Pierce Morgan? Why this stuff don't get out there? You know what? I'm going to be a man. I'm going to be a man. It's my fault. It's my fault for not dropping this content. It's my fault for dropping Diddy content. You know what? I'm going to take the blame. 
It's not our fault, but we need to make a change. I'm going to take the blame. You know what? I'm going to take the blame. It's my fault. It's my fault. From now on, we ain't doing no Diddy videos. We doing these, we exposing everybody else. But I'm going to need y'all help. Y'all need to like. Y'all need to like. Let's get it. And all this shit. And then, and then they might do shit to somebody. And then, and then, and then like, and then like try to like and record it and tell them, oh, if, if you, if you expose us, we're going to post it everywhere. And I know that from word of ear, but I know they do a lot of crazy shit in these, in these houses. A, a lot of weird shit, dude. You know what I'm saying? That shit. It ain't right. You know what I'm saying? I guess that's what Tupac, I guess he wanted to get up out of the Illuminati or something. <laughs> if y'all remember, Tupac used to take these pictures. Well, he was taking these pictures. I think he was in a bathtub or something. It was, but he ain't had no clothes on for real. I, I, ain't, I ain't even gonna look for it. But I remember it was a while back. They had, they started to get, you know what I mean? It, it looked funny. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it, y'all. Certain doors is relationships. You got to build that. So if you ain't got the key, you find somebody with the key and you build that relationship with them. Be like, okay, I got it. It's like, go find a janitor to that door. You know, I I was approached. I was where a person asked me, yo, such and such. And I was just like, nah. And like, you know. Such and such. Like, what like you yo, doing? you know, because at the end of the day, we, you probably make it to where you make it on your own. Right. But a lot of people will offer you something to, to sustain that. On the way. And I, I hate when the interviewer act like he don't know what the guest is talking about. And it sound like Mav. Mav did that same thing with the smart, when smart, when smart guy was up there. I remember when smart guy was on my expert opinion and he was giving all that info about how they be doing the rituals and all that Illuminati, Illuminati, this and this and that. I hate when Mav act like that. Wait, 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 who are you talking about? What? What? What do you mean that? How's that stuff going on? What, what? Like, just acting clueless. All that influence you got, bro, stop doing that. I hate that. I, at that moment, this was, this was, I don't know if it was that person or if this was a whole entity that came with it. Mm -hmm. But I was offered something and I just wasn't with it. Mm -hmm. And when they said, good luck, young man, you're on your own. And I never went platinum since. <laughs> <laughs> you see? Wait, so You see? They laugh. They laugh, but when it but but when it's something to do with Diddy, they understand it fully. They understand it. They anything that got something to do with somebody that look like them, they understand it fully. They know the doctor. They got all the documents. They Google the documents. They print them out. They they read them line for line. But soon as it got something to do with somebody that's higher up, that got some money, some millions, millions. I'm talking about not Diddy money. I'm talking about Epstein money, that type of money. They they laugh. They ain't got nothing. To, oh, who are you talking about? No, I don't know. I don't know. But because they, they scared. But we not scared over here. Yeah, we ain't scared. Um, what did they offer you? YouTube, I'm just playing. This, uh, this is all the act. YouTube, this is all the act. All, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just doing this for entertainment purposes only. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just doing stuff. All right, YouTube, I'm just doing stuff. I'm just plan this is this is just an act let's kick kick did it they were just like you know you walk this way or you you, you come this way and and that's weird ask was, about like sacrifices <laughs> nah i didn't go that far like i was just like yo i was just like all right cool i'm gonna go this way and they, they, that was their exact word what but, impact did they sell you on but did they say hey we can do such and such and such nah they didn't it wasn't it, it wasn't, wasn't like that, that. I, was wasn't, I wasn't i wasn't really wasn't allowed I, yeah if that was the case it, it really wasn't allowed um and or maybe I was bugging. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nah, the thing you wasn't bugging, was, Nori. Don't try to make them feel comfortable. No, don't try to make them feel comfortable. You wasn't bugging. I, they, they trying to act like they don't know what you're talking about. They know exactly what you're talking about. Let's get it, get it. I, I did never go platinum again. All the top Hollywood actors, models, singers, hip hoppers, you name it, is there. And they could be dressed in a disguise. So she was exposed to that. My God, I can't believe that. I can't be a part of that. Oh, what? what Hollywood contract. Right. What you mean you can't be a part of it? If you want your check, you want this Hollywood life, you would be a part of it. And you're not going to share these secrets. She thinks about that. She cried a little bit. They always cry, right? So she said, okay. She goes in this Pandora box, driving this owner, man, owner, woman, owner. 
that's not right. She thinking, I got that over with, so she didn't think it was nothing. She didn't really have to do nothing but me and go kiss a little. She's used to kissing women. Here's the kicker. The three producers, the headliners, the guy who make Hollywood puns like it does, right? Bring her to the upper penthouse tomorrow. So she thinking she getting ready to sign a contract. No, they want to pop her in her ass. And this is how they get down. They call it gravy. If you do get hurt, well. <laughs> Was that the movie Claudine with James Earl Jones? It's an old school movie. Was that Claudine? No, that wasn't Claudine. It was it was another movie I'm thinking of. With a girl, she it was an old school movie because I watch old movies. But she was she was she was trying to be in the entertainment business. Like, yeah, I'm gonna get you in the entertainment business. And they had her in the room. It was a like mad white guys lined up outside of the room. Ready to ready to you know what I mean, pop up. That's just gravy. Now, now, everybody, other people may know you from Gravy and, and, and your music career. It, has this sparked the acting bug? Are we going to see you in a lot more roles following oh, yeah. this? Yeah, yeah, definitely. This is my newfound love. Music is my passion. And, you know, acting, I'm, I'm definitely getting ready to jump into it. Okay. That's a Hollywood slogan for people who just got popped in their behind. Well, how did it go, man? How's your career going? Oh, I can tell you right now, baby, everything's Gravy. But a lot of people that's got their letters on the fly. No, his real name is Gravy. Well, his his rapper name is Gravy. That's the dude who played Biggie. And they read all the, the you know, the literature. They have them in a nice little room or a sweet hotel. It's real elegant. They do it really nice. What the f Oh, no! Y'all knew about this? Bro, this is Shaq and Kevin Hart. Y'all knew about this and didn't say nothing? Y'all knew about this and didn't say anything. Why everybody posting about Diddy? Why isn't this getting posted? Why is he doing this to Kevin Hart? Everybody talking about, yeah, Tasha K lying on Kevin Hart. I can't tell. A lot of people that's got their letters on the fly. And they read all the, the you know, the literature. They have them in a nice little room or a sweet hotel. It's real elegant. They do it really nice. Dude, it's got to do with entertain. What is this? Stop playing. What is this? Nah. Yo, that's Shaq and Kevin Hart. And they let you read that letter and they tell you what you think. I ain't got no problem with this. Okay, sign right here. Now, that's the beginning of the rituals of everything Yo, that's to come for you. Son, I had enough, man. I never seen that before, yo. Yo, I never seen that before. If you seen that before, and you, yo, come on. Come on, y'all. It's not just Diddy, y'all. It's not just Diddy. Let's get, get, get it. All the doors gonna open for you. All the doors are opening. He ain't ready for what they gonna hit him with. So Drake, who goes by the Six God, on October 6th at 6 a.m. dropped his album. And here's the artwork. Listen to how his son, who drew it, describes it. Artwork that you sold me. So the goat was running away from the other mon from the other monsters and and the other animals. He continues on to say his father is the goat. His son drew monsters chasing after the goat. Lately, Drake has been taking on a more feminine Ooh. role, painting his nails. Oh, he's saying that they, they trying to get, oh, cook, cook, cook. Like the picture seen here, yellow, blue, and here, pink. Here he can be seen sporting rainbow hair clips. Here he is doing the same in his new music video. So Drake, who goes by the Six God, drops his album on October. Y'all see what they put on the shirts? Hate Survivor and all of that? Because there's people actually who deal with that stuff. And what happens is when they see it on the shirt, they gravitate. They say, oh, Drake is relatable. Let me go listen to him. Let me go follow him. Then Drake go off and do some dumb shit. And then they in the dumb shit. This is how they, this is how they get people. They become relate. They become relatable, and you go go trying to relate to these guys, and they go 
fill you up with some baby oil. First sixth at 6 a.m. Album cover is him as a goat and is a man who's taking on a more feminine role. 666 is the number of the beast. What is the Baphomet? A man, a woman, a goat the beast and if you take a look around hollywood like actress charlize theron and her son madonna and her son those ain't boys those not boys those not boys hold on hold on we gotta get that back we gotta run this back we gotta run it back i foment a man a woman a goat the beast and if you take a look around hollywood like actress charlize theron and her son that's not no boy that ain't no boy. That's a boy? Yo, son, man. Madonna and her son. Yo, son. Actress Naomi Watts and her son. Dwayne Wade, son. Yo, son. Yo, it's right up under our nose. I don't care if this video do go red. You know, I'm still uploading. It. So what? So what? I know they're going to make it go red. Yo, we got to fight, y'all. We got to fight. Y'all got to help me fight. All y'all do is got to like the, like the video so it can get pushed out there. Yo, this is sad. 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 Her son, actress Megan Fox, who does blood rituals with her boyfriend. Actress Marcia Harden, who says all four of her children are daughter of Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. You can clearly see there's a spiritual war happening between the light and darkness. And Jesus said he is the light of the world and those that follow him shall not walk in darkness, but have the light of life. Y'all. Y'all. If y'all got any good in y'all, I know a lot of y'all don't know, don't create content and all that. You know what I'm saying? Do your part. All you do is gotta like the video as you watching. I know that I know when I do videos outside of the Drake Kendrick Lamar beef and all of that, it don't do. We gonna make this joint bubble, cause I'm not gonna stop. I'm not lifting my foot off their neck till everybody go down. Everybody needs to go down. Y'all join me in this quest of taking Hollywood down. Y'all ready? Don't back out. We are warriors. Get it, gang. Let's get, get, get it. Big Kish signing out. Y'all let me know what y'all think of this video, man. Everybody got to go down. Y'all let me know what y'all think of the video, man. Big Kish is out. Get it, gang. I need y'all to like this video so we can get out and take Hollywood down. The evil people. Take them down, y'all. All right?